Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm gonna to show you how to disable the auto off feature on the Keurig K-Select model number K80. So the K-Select looks like this. It's a Keurig machine. It will shut off automatically after two hours if this little green light is on. The auto off, when that light is on, that means the auto off is enabled and the coffee maker will shut off after two hours automatically. We can disable that, we gotta turn that light off. So the first thing you're gonna do is leave it plugged in, but power down the machine. So with it powered down, we got these are our brew buttons. This is six, this is six, eight, 10, 12. And here's our strong button. So with it powered down, we wanna hold the strong button and the 10 ounce button, so six, eight, 10. We wanna hold these for three seconds until the light goes out. See the auto light came on, it went out, let up. Now when I power it on, that green light is not on, this unit will stay powered on until I turn it off. So with it powered on, it's gonna keep that internal tank temperature up to temperature all the time. So you may hear it uh, cycling that water, heating that water off and on. So now let's say you wanna turn that back on, just do the reverse, so turn it off, hold the strong and the 10 ounce button until the auto off light comes on. It came on, well it just came on for a second, but now when I press the button on, I power the unit on, the auto off light is lit, the unit will turn off after two hours after the last brew. Check out, I've got other simple videos on this, I've got how to clean the needles, I've got how to add a water filter, how to descale it, so when your descale light comes on, I show you how to descale it. Thanks everybody for watching.